Thank everyone for watching and stay tuned next time for episode four, which begins right now. <laughs> I love that. Hello, everybody, and welcome to episode four of the Legacy Challenge. We bring you once again to the home of Athena Johnson, new security guard at, like, the freaking mall or something. And she's, uh, she's struggling to make it in this little house, but she's doing all right. She even has a little love interest, you see? Things are hanging Indeed. off with uh, Benjamin Long. I mean, she's eventually going to have to save up for a bigger bed, too. I just remembered that she has bills. We want to take care of that as soon as possible. Yeah. I wonder if we can uh, do that today. That's probably a good idea. Uh, the, right, well, so. lo looking at her house, the bills probably won't cost much at all. So. Mm -hmm. so she's sleeping. Sleeping, creeping, eating the Sleeping pie. with the creepers. Sounds like a bad... Yeah. It sounds like something you threaten someone with in Minecraft, like, instead of sleeping with the fishes, you're going to sleep with the creepers tonight. <laughs> it really does. Alright, she wants to be friends with her best friends with him. She wants to gain... What skill point does she want? <laughs> you might want to have her point. become friends with Brandy, actually, you know, for future promotion purposes. Yeah, it's probably a good idea. Alright. <coughs> let's, uh, let's you... Actually, look, look, we'll have some... Have breakfast. Have some cereal, because you will not burn anything down if you have cereal. Indeed. Oh man. So gonna have some cereal. The cereal's easy and fun. Everyone likes cereal. Especially like um wait, who's this person? Christy, say hi to Christy, just because the more people you know, the better it is for you. Except But I don't think we can really spend too much time talking to her, so we're gonna say has to leave immediately after we... Oh, she shoot her away, wow. That was rude. Is there, any, is there anything left there? No, it's empty. Alright, use that. Then use the toilet. Oh, man. And we, and after we use the toilet, we're gonna have to swap it out. <laughs> swap it out for a shower once again. Yeah, that's how, that's how we have to do it. Until... Oh, did you pay our bills? No, we're going to do that next. Alright, first of all... They're probably going to be like $12 or something silly like that. Yeah, because it's a tiny house with almost nothing. Alright, yeah, put them down over there. Can you imagine yeah, how nice see. it would be for you? Bum, can, you imagine playing, paying, can you imagine paying $12 for a place? That would be rather nice. It's like, your entire utility bills for a month are 12 bucks, including rent and mortgage and all that shit. It's kind of <laughs> funny. When I lived in my good town apartment, which was basically just like one tiny room, the electrical, the electrical bill during some months of the year when I wasn't running the heater was um, like $16 for the electrical bill for the entire month. Was it that apartment, like in, uh, the, the apartment, you're talking about the one on Williams, in, uh, Williamsport? Yeah, that Williamsport, because 10, before that. It was so, it was such a tiny apartment that, like, I didn't know you had... Cost less than a dollar a day. Oh, oh she, she misses I remember her toilet. The... She misses her toilet. I feel so bad for her. She, like, she gets mostly attached to her bathroom stuff, and then it goes away. <laughs> she needs to get rid of it all the time. I'd, I'd, I'd feel upset, too. All uh, right. And then after that, read a book. Because we need to be in a good mood to talk to your, to your, uh, your man. To your lover boy. All right, read that book. Read it good. We'll zoom in to the, the reading person. Oh, 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 you're not done. Get back, get back, read more. Reading is good for you, goddammit. Yeah, keep on the reading track. What's up? Oh, man. Which reminds me of some reason of Reading Rainbow. Remember Reading Rainbow? <laughs> I guess I do. Well, I, I, that was cool stuff. I'm actually awesome enough to remember that. Mm -hmm. 
He's out working? Aww. Damn it. Well, in that case, you want to become friends with uh, Brandy, just ca call her up and chat. Actually, yeah, I know for a fact she doesn't have a job. Not stamp. Uh, spray. Just take care of the roaches first. I know you're going to lose points. A thousand a shot every time she has to do it. That's pretty, uh, it's pretty severe. Yeah, that is severe. Well, she really hates cockroaches, I guess. Let's see. Hire an exterminator. You don't have the money. Well, that's 50 bucks, right? Still I think it is, yeah. You know, I don't know if that's worth it. Oh, wait. I just tried to call her. I just tried to call him. We were going to call, we were going to call the other girl, right? What was her name? Ban Brandy. Yep, Brandy. Yeah, Brand Brandy. And Brandy's not a townie, I know that for a fact. She's in the neighborhood. She's a, an unemployed single mother with two sons. Her son is the one who brings home the money for them. Yes, I do know the name. I do remember the name Baroque. Yeah. They really didn't have messages in the corner. Continue talking. Continue the chatter the chatterations. Uh, negative. There's no negative allowed. It's like I don't be friends with you, but you're a bitch. You're a bitch. You ate you shoot everyone out of my house so you could eat your sandwich. Yeah. Like yeah, how she, dare you She technically that. doesn't know that. Did that that like help her at all become better friends a little bit? I think it did. Mm. Oh yeah. Now can we call can we call Loverboy now? Maybe. I think we should just talk, but there's not enough time between before we look. So we're just gonna talk and chat a little bit. Talking about hot soup and spatulas. Maybe those are euphemisms for other things. <laughs> oh, I'm sure they are. It's hard to know. Okay, well that was a good chat. Now call Brandy again. You're just gonna be on the phone all day. Blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 blah. Oh, and the phone rings. Answer the phone. Hey, it's him. Hey, he called her back, and she wants to talk, he wants to talk about scrambled eggs. He wants to scramble her eggs. Oh, baby. <laughs> and this random chick is standing out there. Okay, she's gone. All right. Well, you have like two minutes to read a book or something. That's like your only entertainment right now, and it isn't very satisfying for you, because your phone level is always so low. <laughs> There's no lights in her house, so I don't even know how she sees to read, you know? She just doesn't, I guess. Mm -hmm. Alright, and the one time she has to stop reading, she's not doing it on her own. It's kind of funny. <laughs> Alright, enough of that. Hang up the book. Or, put it away, I guess. <laughs> and get in the car. Time to go to work. Meet me. Oh man, they're slowly getting somewhere in the relationship. Off she goes. Alright, so we are going to let this go fast. And the legacy challenge is a fun thing. This is nice. Indeed. It's going to be interesting, like... If I follow through with this and keep it going, to look back on it to like later on and say, this is really how they started in this situation. Yes. It's like the, the increase of wealth is a thing. And one thing I also have to make a decision about is, do I give any of these elixir of life? And if so, how much, you know? You can give them elixir of life. It's completely okay with the rules. So. Mm -hmm. But the question is, should I? It's hard to, it's hard to know, really. It's up to you, dude. If you feel like you should do it, then go for it. Mm-hmm. So she is... Oh, she used the bathroom at work. That's convenient. Now she doesn't have to sell the shower. Again. I like that they actually do that. I, I do like that. Mm -hmm. That's a nice improvement they made over The Sims 1, the where Sims your needs one, just get worse. <laughs> so many times I've had someone either pass out or pee themselves at the moment they got out of the car. Oh god, I've had that happen to me too. Once I had a sim starved to death after they got out of the car. <laughs> well, I was like, I had a good day at work today. Oh god, no food. Uh, today was good. Oh. Collapse. Alright, it's time for her to go right to bed. I think. Does she have enough? Give her a toilet, dude. She's got enough money for it now. Maybe tomorrow. 
<laughs> Put it by I'll the chair. I'll buy it. I'll buy the toilet. Alright. Dude, she's moving up in the world. We have a toilet and a shower. I mean, granted, yeah, they, they, was still, a they still are in the kitchen, but, you know. We're moving up. That was the bedroom. Yes. And anyway, since she's in bed, that brings us to the end of the fourth episode. I want to thank everyone for watching, and I'll see you again for episode.